The COVID-19 vaccines are said to be extremely effective in helping create the antibodies that fight the virus. But many are also curious about natural immunity following a COVID-19 infection. In our weekly Q&A with Toronto's Associate Medical Officer of Health, some of our viewers asked whether the immunity achieved via a vaccine is better than natural immunity and why. We're still learning a lot about immunity and it's, you know, why do we get colds m many times a year, even by the same virus? Like, wh or why do we get a cold every year, even by a coronavirus? Uh -huh. For some reason, some viruses, some infections don't lead to lifelong immunity, where some do. If you actually got a natural measles infection, a natural chickenpox infection, you would have that uh, mostly lifelong uh, natural immunity that lasts. But it's not the case for all viruses, especially those respiratory viruses. That's why they bother us every year. Right. And so um, getting COVID gives you immunity. And we say that the immunity lasts for at least 90 days. But beyond that, it's really hard to determine whose immunity lasts for longer than that. Some people, it, it wanes right away. Some people, it lasts longer. So um, you usually do have that short-term uh, infect uh, immunity, and that's why, you know, in Ontario, we're allowing kind of that 90-day period. But we do know that you can get uh, infected again. We know that that immunity doesn't uh, last. What about vaccines? Well, you're getting more than one vaccine. Most um, most of them are more than one vaccine, yeah. and that second dose acts to boost boost your immunity. And again, we're still waiting to see, with even with the two doses of, say, uh, a Pfizer or a mixed messenger RNA series, do you need a third booster dose? Some people are recommended that right now, and mm -hmm. we're waiting to see how long that immunity uh, does last or how strong it stays strong for. For more answers about vaccines and other COVID concerns, plus to submit your questions for our next Q&A, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash COVID answers. For City News, I'm Dilshad Berman.